CJ Monlea. What a nice pass. Rubio back in. Watch how this offense. That ball knocked away. Lillard picks it up. Rubio chasing, and Dame will get to the rim and lay it in. Go trying to go inside to Wiggins. This is for the tie. No. Rebound tipped in the air by Plumley. He grabs it. Jump ball. He in towns. Easy scoring. Here's Aminu up ahead of the pack. Flips it at the rim off the glass. Boy, going full speed. 106-101, Blazers get the victory over the Minnesota Timberwolves. Minnesota on their opening night and with a talented roster. and They won their first two games, which were on the road, Mike Rice, and the Blazers had to come in here and fight that. They had to fight the opening night crowd. Place was packed. They jumped out to a 17-point lead. Blazers, though, showed some poise. They came back, handed the ball to Damian Lillard. Then in the third quarter, he kind of took over, and then they closed the door with some good defense and rebounding. You know, it's interesting, the post-game show with Lillard on. He said, "I." and when you listen to him, he really has a battle plan. I wanted to get everyone involved. And all you have to do is look at Aminu. He's the guy that you have to get involved. You can't have him standing in the corners like Dallas did a year ago and until the end of the season. Lillard's getting those guys involved right away. They're handling the ball. They're taking tough shots. And that's why a guy like Aminu and Crab, they can win games for you when the defense piles up on CJ and Lillard. Those guys can keep you in the game. Well, and if you're looking for heroes in this one, you go down the list. Lillard, yes, had the 34. McCollum had big buckets. How about Plumley with the big tie-up late and then was fouled by Towns? A huge moment in this game. Aminu, you mentioned him. Alan Crabb, who had not been shooting it well, has the big strip on Kevin Martin to ice it. Blazers get the victory. Their first road win of the season now are 2-2, two and, two, and Wednesday night take on the Jazz in Utah.